My precious! <laughs> Whoa! That's a lot of poppets! Awesome! I'm gonna pop them all! Ahem, what is going on here? Oh, hi, Sammy! I just saw all this and. Uh, uh, These are not to play with, Susan! This is my precious poppet collection! Okay, okay, Mimi. Are you at least aware of how you can use poppets? Of course! I'm a real expert in it. You can pop these bubbles from one side or another, or you can uh, set a poppet speed contest with your friends. Wait, and that's it? Just pop the bubbles? Oh, Susan, that's kind of art. What would you say if I showed you the real art, or better, a craft way to use these thingies? I'd say interesting. Hi, guys. Today I'm going to show Sammy a few awesome poppet hacks, which will totally make his life more interesting. Thrilled as I am to see those, then give a thumbs up! Okay, Susie, go on, impress me! This won't be hard. <laughs> Check this out. Isn't this your favorite type of rainbow? Yahoo! Hold your horses, cowboy. We're gonna make something spectacular with these candies. Alrighty. Let's take one candy and put it straight into the bubble like this. Here comes another one. Guys, you don't need to follow any exact order. Just use your imagination to the fullest! Good point, Sammy. Great! Now we're gonna need chocolate. A lot of chocolate. Sue, don't tell me that I can't have it either! Don't worry, Sammy. You will taste it later. And now we're gonna use some magic. Ta-da! Would you guys look at this perfect consistency? Whoa! Now we'll simply pour our melted chocolate straight into the poppet this way. All the way through it so that it covers all the M&Ms. Be careful and don't get burned. Mmm, it looks so yummy, right? My mouth is watering. I can't wait to try this thing already. Susie, I think I'm finally getting your idea. That's terrific. We're almost done. All we've got to do is wait till the chocolate hardens again. And then we can carefully take our brand new chocolate bar out of the poppet. Like this. Wow, Susie. It looks magical. And I bet it tastes really good, too. Oh, that we can check right now. Mmm, I like it. Okay, that's enough, Sue. I want to try it, too. And you can keep showing those poppet hacks, but only if they are as amazing as this one. <laughs> they may be even better. <laughs> right. For our next craft, we need to get rid of those partitions inside the poppet fidget. Be very careful working with the scissors, guys. Like this. Is this going to be another tasty craft, Sue? Because I'm ready! You guessed right. Okay, that's it. By the way, Sammy, could you wash this properly? Well, since you don't have a more complicated task for me. In the meantime, we'll use our little stove. Guys, this is called isomalt. You can ask your parents to buy it for you in the nearest candy store. Did someone say candy? Oh, Sammy. Now let's add a tiny bit of water and stir the whole thing until we get a uniform structure. This way. Something tells me you're gonna need this. Oh, thank you. Right on time. Guys, it's important that your isomalt is about 180 degrees Celsius. Great, and since it's really hot, you need to work extremely carefully and fast enough. We divided our isomalt into six even parts, and now we're going to color it. Here comes the green. Just one little drop will be enough. Oh, really, Sammy? Who knew? <laughs> Aha! That's the main idea! <laughs> exactly, Sammy. The next step is as simple as can be. We are going to pour our colored isomalt into the poppet. Following the order of its colors, of course. This way. And we finish the red row. Great! Remember to be careful, Susan! And you guys may ask an adult to help you at this stage. 
Here we go. Oh, I'm kind of feeling like Willy Wonka. Then that makes me an Oompa Loompa. Ha <laughs> ha. this gloop. Augustus gloop. Augustus gloop. <laughs> now we need to insert a popsicle stick this way. And let our lollipop set. I can help with that. Today we're working with... Puppet. A lollipop you can all greet. Wow, Sammy, your Oompa Loompa magic works like a charm. Check this out, guys. Our poppet candy is finally ready. And I'm ready to taste it. Oh, Sue, you're a great candy man! But now I'm all sticky. I need to wash myself. And our next craft will help you with that. We'll need a poppet and some melted soap base of any color you like. Like this, for example. We froze it all and got a wonderful soap bar. Let's take it out. Wow, so beautiful. But why is it partially violet? La, 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 la. Oop, oopsie. Guys, if you're as amazed by these hacks as I am, give us a thumbs up and I'll be right back. Mm, I'm fresh and clean again. What's next, Sue? Well, you do know how much I like watermelons, right? That's why. Whoa, it looks tasty. You're right, Sammy. Come, help me cut it. With great pleasure. hi -ya! That was impressive, thanks. Now we're gonna need a blender. It's more convenient to use a handheld one. We'll simply dip it into our watermelon. Be careful working with household appliances, guys. Nice watermelon juice, huh? Now let's add about this amount of gelatin powder. There we go. Did you already pick a poppet for this craft, Sammy? Uh-huh, let it be a unicorn! Oh, I like the way you think. Guys, here, I'll need a pinch of magic. Voila! Now we need to fill our poppet bubbles with this gelatin mixture. This way. I'm using a squeeze bottle. But you can also try and use a pastry tube to do this. Guys, while Sue's is busy, take a second to subscribe to our channel. There are a lot of cool videos there. All right, the gelatin has finally cooled down. And we've got a whole bunch of amazing watermelon gummies. Give me cheddar, Susie. All your hacks today are truly amazing. But maybe you'll agree to follow my instructions. And make one more thing. Sure, Sammy, bring it on. Take small scissors. Got it. Then make a few holes in the center of the star. Okay. Guys, be very careful at this stage because the scissors are usually very sharp. And whoop. Am I doing it right, Sammy? Very good! Now, make one hole in each beam of the star. I hope you don't mind if I use some magic. Done! And finally, you need to insert these diodes in the openings. Got it. And one. And two. And three! What a nice little night lamp we've got! It's done, Sammy! Here, take the half that I was making. Oh, now we can attach one star to another like this and get an even cooler little night lamp than I could imagine. Doesn't it look great, guys? Why don't we recollect all poppet hacks from today? Guys, we had such a great time with you today. Yeah, thanks for being with us. What craft did you like the most? Oh, I like that one too. Give this video a thumbs up and tell your friends about our channel. See you soon, boys and girls. Bye-bye. Huh? What? 
Um, okay. Huh? Huh? What in the world? Uh, hmm. Oh, come on! Uh, that's it. I'm done. Susie, ouch! What happened? Today's not my day at all. I'm not gonna go anywhere. I'll stay here and watch TV. I know you won't. The upstairs neighbor is remodeling his house and he accidentally caught our cable. I already called the service. Oh, what a dreadful day! Ugh. Easy, Sue. Don't be so nervous. I seem to be stressed out. I know what can help you. I need a unicorn craft. Hi, guys. Today we're gonna make a cool bright puppet that can help you if you want to relax after a really hard day. And it will look like a unicorn! <laughs> Just it's had to be more precise. But don't worry, guys. No unicorn was harmed when making this video. <laughs> For this craft, I'm gonna use rainbow magic. Like this. Um, what's wrong? For a real unicorn expert. Whoosh! Whoa, Sammy! Awesome! How did you do that? Sue, the horn is the main magical resource. You can do anything without it. Now I see. Let's return to our craft. We'll need this piece later. Guys, I'm really impressed by Sam's knowledge about unicorns. If you're too, give him a thumbs up. Pay attention that the colorful piece is a little bit bigger. We need this for a smooth edge. Yes, that's right, Sammy. Try not to miss a spot in order to make it well secured. Guys, be very careful with the glue gun. One can easily get burned. Mm. Sam, do you know the answer to the main question of our time? What is the difference between Poppet and Simple Dimple? Sue, don't try to trip me out. It's easy. Poppet has more bubbles, and all of them are all the same size. All right. Could you please bring me a piece of white foam paper? You mean this one? Yes, thanks. <laughs> Guys, be careful with the hair straightener. Ask an adult to help you at this stage. Let me guess, Sue! Go ahead, Sammy. We'll put a piece of foam paper on top of something round and use a glue stick cap to press a little bit to fix the shape. Exactly. <laughs> Sammy, you guessed right. Just look at this bubble. Try it, Sue! Uh-huh. Perfect. But for this craft, we need some more. Let's use unicorn magic. Woo! That will do just fine. As you can see, we've already inserted all the bubbles inside because it takes quite a while. <laughs> now we're gonna make special partitions using these colorful strips. All right. Like this. And now let's place it… So, I've been wondering. A few years ago, Papa didn't even exist, right? So, there was no way to relieve stress? Of course no, Sammy. My mom told me that she still likes to pop bubble wrap as she did many years ago. Oh, actually it looks quite similar. <laughs> <laughs> I can see you've already started a comparison experiment. We glue this right here. Uh, the experiment got out of control. <laughs> Try it, Sue. It's fun. <laughs> yeah, that's great, Sammy. But bubble wrap has one big disadvantage. It's totally impossible to reuse it. Which only makes things worse. We need to take care of our planet. It's the only one we have. Yes, that's right, Sammy. But let's continue our craft. One question before we do. How does this hat fit me? <laughs> huh. It looks vaguely familiar. Or should I choose this one? <laughs> it seems to me you want to tell me something. I want to show you my hat collection. Close your eyes. Wow. Okay. Huh? Wow, Sammy, that's exactly what we need for the second part of our craft! You're always great when it comes to unicorns! And the reason is simple! I just love them! Guys, do you remember our foam paper piece? So now it's the time to use it! Let's get started! <laughs> Guys, did you see our unicorn crafts we did before? What do you mean, no? We made a 3D paper model and a cute unicorn school supplies! I strongly recommend you to watch those videos. Sue, can we spit up a little bit? Pretty please? Of course. I can't wait to see the result too. All right. There we go. <laughs> Done. So, what do you say? It came out so great, Sue! A 
agreed. Now we have whole two gray puppets! White and colorful! Isn't that great, guys? <laughs> Sammy, you're not even close. Our puppet is gonna be double-sided. That's even better! Can you help me? Did you doubt my brilliance? Of course I can! I'll show ya! Oh, I'm sure now he'll do his best to prove me wrong. <laughs> In the meantime, we're gonna glue all the sides together. Mm -hmm. Susie, all done! According to your speed, you're a real master. I take it back. You can do everything. <laughs> there. I told you so. Watch and learn. Whoa! He matches all these colorful rainbow bubbles so well. You're the best, Sammy. By the way, I think we should cover the edges so the craft looks neat and nice. <laughs> That's a wonderful idea, Sammy. Let's glue this strip like this. Guys, be careful not to glue yourself. <laughs> All right. Press it well on the sides. Perfect fit. It, the most interesting part is left. Decoration! Yeah, that's right, Sammy. La la la! Rainbow magic! Sammy, where did you put your unicorn horn? Do you mean this one? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. There, there. You have your own slime power, don't you remember? <sighs> okay, fine. I'll do anything for a cool craft. Huh. What do you say, Sammy? Um, it's not that I'm an expert in sizes, but don't you think it's a little bit too small? Yes, Sammy, you're right. That means we're gonna make a new one that will fit well. And we're going to make it by using polymer clay. First, we need to knead the polymer clay well. Like this. And then to divide it into two equal parts! <laughs> Good guess! Here we go. Now we need to roll it in a piece like this. So that one end is thicker than the other. So we're so lucky! I have my unicorn power back! Look for yourself! <gasps> wow! Great job! You even put them together! Now it's time to twist! Yeah, come on! Let's twist again! you're in a good mood. <laughs> I saw a lot of energy. <laughs> of course! We're at the finish line! Soon we can play with this wonderful poppet. Uh, now you're excited too, aren't you? Oh, yeah. And this skewer goes right here. Okay. I really like the shape, but why don't we make it brighter, right? I'll supervise the style you choose. <laughs> no one can really deny that a golden horn looks much more stylish. <laughs> Ahem! That's the job for a true master of decor. Let me help you, Sue. La 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 la. So how do you like it? <laughs> Whoa! It's awesome! I'm glad you like it. I hope there are no remaining doubts about my skills, Sue. <laughs> but some glitter remained on your face. <laughs> well, that's an occupational hazard, right? <laughs> okay, let's do it. You will sit on top like this. Perfect! Wow, Sue! It's so great and charming! What can be cuter than a unicorn? Huh? Feeling no stress at all. <laughs> and this wonderful design makes you feel like you're in fairy tale, right? Absolutely. Uh, did you finish? I want to try too. Of course, Sammy. Come here. <laughs> well, what do you think? I think anybody can have a bad day, but this toy is a nice way to cheer yourselves up. Guys, subscribe to our channel so you won't miss our great relaxing craft. You won't believe this! I got a job interview! Oh, this is my dream job! And I'm gonna have to take a train! I'm so nervous! Don't 
Don't be Susan! As an extremely experienced specialist in this field, I'll help you! Whoa! What are these? These won't let you get bored on the road. And a board game will help you make new friends. Trust me! Oh, I remember how once back in Chibadaba I played cards. And I won over that guy, you know! <laughs> how could this happen? Ugh. Yes! I won! Oh, yes! He turned out to be that famous country leader. And of course, you're gonna need these in case you get hungry! Well, thanks, but they told me to bring... Only my resume and a cell phone. Oh, fine. Well, having something tasty surely wouldn't hurt, though. <gasps> Holy cannoli! I just realized that I don't have a suitable bag to fit all this! Let's craft a new bag for you, then! It won't take long! And it looks like we'd better make it stress-relieving. Hi, everyone! Today, Sammy will help me make a perfect little bag that will fit everything I need for my job interview. Hi, guys! We've already created a few bags in our videos, and I bet you know where to find those! Up first, we gotta decide on its shape. Let's see… Hmm, no. This won't do. Oh, and this is way too small. Now we're talking! All right, it's time to pick the color. A creative purse can't stay white, right? Let me do it, Sue! You know I have exquisite taste! Hmm, let's see. Oh, I like this one, but that color is great too! Ugh, I'm confused! I know what we can do, Mr. Head Scratcher! <laughs> we'll use all of these colors! Wow! Susie, this is amazing! <laughs> I know, right? But since we're making a purse, we're gonna need two pieces like this. Now, let's proceed. We need… Wait, wait! I thought you might need something to calm down your nerves! A poppet? I won't look professional taking this with me. Hello! It can become a part of your bag! We're just gonna need to make a few adjustments! Will you hold that for me? Sure! bibbidi bobbidi zub scrimmity Great! Guys, before we proceed with the poppet, we need to reinforce our main bag pieces. As always, be very careful with the cutter. Guys, if you're a regular on our channel, you know what we gotta do next! A foam paper glue sandwich! Take this, Susie! <laughs> right you are! First comes this piece seasoned with some special glue. It will hold the foam paper better than anything else. Now comes this bright piece. Press it really well, guys! And on top of it, we'll glue this beautiful turquoise piece of foam paper. Turquoise? I already attached the pink one to this piece! Don't worry, Sammy. Pink also looks awesome. Am I right, guys? We'll be right back after a short break. Don't you go anywhere! Okay, guys. Let's wrap it up with the poppet part of our bag. Whoosh! Great! Now we will glue this piece right here. That's gonna be the inner part of the bag. Right, Susie? Absolutely! Check this out! For the next step, we're gonna need a metal ball! How do I know this? Cause we've already made a puppy in one of our episodes! <laughs> That's right! Then this time, I think we can speed up this process. And this is what you should get, guys! 24 Poppet Bubbles! Now we need to glue them from both sides of this bag piece. Here are the foam paper strips, Sue. Cut and painted. As you wanted! Good job, Sammy. I'm sure that you wouldn't mind a bit of craft magic here, guys. Whoop! Awesome! Uh-huh. That's right. On the way? Got it! Sue, did you finish with the poppet already? How do you like it? <laughs> this is really fun! <laughs> pop! Pop! Just check this out, guys! But let's get back to business! Now we can finally deal with the zipper! Everything is pretty simple here, guys! All we need to do is glue these foam paper strips all around the zipper. Just be very careful with the hot glue! Don't burn your fingers! Please note that you are gonna need to use that special foam paper glue to attach the zipper piece to the front and back sides of your bag! And this is what you should get in the end! Pretty cool, right? I like it! There we go! So, you're saying the delivery will be here in five minutes? Okay! Susie, how much more time do you think we need here? 
hard to say. Now it seems like our bag looks a bit plain from the inside. Well, I can help you solve that problem. Give way! Hop, hop, hop. Well, what do you say? <gasps> Guys, would you look at this? What a nice pocket to store a cell phone. Oh, and you've attached a magnet here. I love it. Think like a pro, work like a pro. <laughs> hey, I see that you've made something as well. Yep, not a single piece of paper will wrinkle in this pocket. By the way, Sammy, what delivery were you talking about back there? I already told you! That's gonna be a surprise! Be patient! Well, then it better be here on time, because as far as I'm concerned, we're done here! Whoosh! Check this out, guys! Cool and simple! My favorite type of craft! Hmm, don't you think that this bag still looks not so beautiful enough? Are you saying what I think you're saying, Susan? More decor! <laughs> Guys, what do you think is the best bag decor ever, hmm? Let me ask you this question once again! What is the world's best bag decor ever, people? That's right! We're gonna make our bag look like a cute unicorn! And this time we will be working in a quite unusual technique! Huh? Wow, would you look at this? Huh, what's so unusual about that, Sue? Could you turn around? Okay… We are going to make some sort of an application. You know, it's when you create a picture from many different pieces. Like a puzzle? <laughs> that's right, like a puzzle. And that's it. Well, Sammy, what do you say? <sighs> Ahem, Sammy? Ah, Susie, I was making cute sleepy eyes for a unicorn and I guess I fell asleep for just a second. Oh, you sleepyhead! <laughs> Great job with these eyes! What do you say, guys? Give Sammy a bunch of thumbs ups! And here comes the final piece! Hey, do you mind closing your eyes for a second? What? Er, uh, okay. Ta da! Hmm, but what's changed? Ah, you made this border out of a foam paper strip! Nice move, Sammy! Special delivery for Sue! Oh, that's me! I wonder what we have here! <gasps> oh, my feta! This is the only thing our cool bag was missing! You're right, thanks for taking care of that! And… hop! In order to fix the strap on our handbag, we've made the holders from cardboard and foam paper. Awesome! Guys, let's check out our craft in all its glory! Gotta go now! Susie, are you sure that you won't take a board game with you? <laughs> yes, Sammy, I'm sure. Don't worry. Besides, I won't be away for too long. Alright, all I need is here. I can go now. Before you do, please show us your brand new stylish bag one more time! Well, if you insist. Guys, if you liked our craft today, support and if you plan on making such a cool bag, definitely subscribe to our channel! We're waiting! Don't forget to hit the bell button, guys! See you in our next video!